Hey ho, I'm Alaric Hall. I work at the University of Leeds in the School of English here. Um, and I was presented with this sea of possible topics for, um, you know, for podcasts. Um, and from this sea, I picked this one, um, Beyond A.C. Bradley and F.R. Leavis, The Critics and How to Handle Them. So that's just been kind of thrown out there by one or another A-level examiner. And uh, I kind of thought it was an interesting one to, to have a go at. Um, and I'm actually more kind of anxious or trepidatious um, about this particular podcast than I'm about any of the others because um, I'm conscious I might basically give you a load of advice that works for me here at university and for what I'm trying to get my students to do but actually may not uh, really sit very well with what your teachers want you to do at A level. So you're going to have to take a kind of critical view of what I'm saying uh, to kind of relate what I'm saying to what you've been told in class and stuff um, and maybe to talk to your teachers or, or you know, whoever's kind of guiding you through your A-levels um, about um, how useful this advice is for what you're doing because the kind of advice I'm giving you is the kind of advice that um, I would be giving to my undergraduates here at the University of Leeds and what I'm trying to get my undergraduates to do here at Leeds is to write and think um, like professional scholars um, and so in a way what I'm asking you to do is to start thinking like people like me um, who professionally write academic research um, and in a way that's a tall order and it won't always fit with what you're expected to do at A-level but hopefully you'll find it useful and, and it'll all kind of come together. Um, so yeah this, this question is phrased it says beyond AC Bradley beyond FR Leavis. I don't know if you've heard of AC Bradley or F.R. Leavis. If you're in a class, might try and do a show of hands, don't know. Um, I, I've heard of Leavis, I haven't read anything by him. I once asked one of his students to go and read something by him and, and they said it was useful, so that's great. Um, never heard of A.C. Bradley, don't know, so I have no idea quite where, you know, where, where this guy's coming from. Um, I suspect he's coming from about the 1950s. Um, and, and the way I'm going to try and help you to think about dealing with kind of scholars is a kind of 21st century way that, that I'm used to. But it's amazing how like, different academics will get inf inflamed with rage um, on the subject of how you should go about kind of relating to scholarship and stuff. So you will get other different opinions as well. Uh, other people will have different views from me.